This story is called Do We by Pop and Lock 11. A teenage boy by the name of John went to a middle school far up west. His best friend Felix would always meet him in the hallways in between class to talk for a while about girls, games, and you too. After their chat, they would head back to class before being marked late. On one particular afternoon, after classes were over, they met outside. Want to come over later on today? asked John. I don't know if I can, but I will try, replied Felix. Later that evening, Felix had not shown up at John's house. Around 9 p.m., as John sat on his porch, just before he had finally given up hope, out of the corner of his eye, John saw a dark, shadowy figure race past the corner streetlight. It had raced out of his neighbor's yard. John could not believe his eyes and could not make out what the figure was. Filled with fear, John stared intensely at the street corner. A few seconds later, the figure raced out again, but this time John was able to see what it was. It looked like a silhouette of a human on a bicycle. The figure raced out again, this time a bit slower than before. It stopped pedaling as it slowly turned its head. The shadowy figure stared at John. It opened its big, bright, penetrating red eyes. It then rode away slowly while staring at John. John screamed and ran inside as the figure faded off into the darkness. The next day, at school, John was still shaking from what he had seen the night before. John met Felix in the hallway just before class. I'm sorry I couldn't go over to your house last night. I was riding my bike with my two friends last night. John mentioned to him what he had seen the night before. They were ghosts or demons or something, John said with a frightened tone. Felix looked calm. Felix's eyes slowly turned red as he said, Well, we don't believe in ghosts, do we?